Okay, so today is um, Friday, 24th of July, 2020, and it's late. It's about uh, uh, 8.40, 2040 hours, and I have a croissant here. Um, I forgot to take videos during lunch. I've got cucumbers, I've got uh, finely sliced um, rose onions, I've got a thinly sliced uh, ripe tomato here. I've got uh, greens here, a mixture of uh, juliennes of green serrano chili, mint and down kasum, and uh, scallion as well. And here I have roasted aubergine. So um, I know I'm not supposed to eat baguettes because they have a high amount of butter, which is lipids. I bought two of these. We only finished once a uh, one. Uh, my daughter had most of it. Um, no, she just had a little bit. I finished the rest. <laughs> so, okay. So, I bought two of these this morning from the bread shop in Damansara Heights, which um, makes excellent, um, it's an excellent bakery. They, they really know how to bake their bread and their tarts and their scones. Um, anyway, um, I've loaded it up. Uh, and, and I've toasted the um, croissant with uh, garlic in it. I, I had smashed them in my mortar and pestle here. So uh, the only thing I don't have is my um, barbecue sauce because I gave all my open my my one small open tester jar to my daughter, as well as the small uh, jars. So I only have. Uh, five big jars left which are for sale so I don't want to open one of these because they're for sale so I'm not having it with um, my barbecue sauce which was the whole raison d'etre of eating this thing so anyway I've got um, one piece of wholemeal baguette unopened and I've got um, a quarter of a baguette in the air fryer which I'll toast if I feel this is not enough and I need something more to eat uh, tonight. I just recovered from my food coma at 6 o'clock today. Uh, my daughter came for lunch. She left at 2, so I basically passed out between 2 and 6. That's how good my food is. In case any of you are doubt, uh, doubting um, the deliciousness and awesomeness of my food. Everything I cook is healthy food, except for the occasional uh, baguette, I suppose. So you don't have to feel too guilty about picking out on my foods. So you can find out more about my whole food plant-based recipes at bit.ly slash WFPB by Aslan. Okay, that's a uh, whole food plant-based by Aslan. I've got about... 125 video recipes on YouTube, which I put in the public domain. It's my gift to humanity. Okay, so that's it for tonight. Friday, 24th of July, 2020. Okay, again, it's uh, Friday, 24th of July, 2020, and the time is uh, about 2100 hours. It's 2055 or so, uh, five minutes to nine in the evening, and I'm about to have my baguette. Um, uh, it's a quarter for baguette. Okay, I bought these at the bread shop in Damansara Heights, Jalan Sedek Kasi, and um, I've already put a layer of three slices of cucumber and slices of uh, ripe tomatoes here. These are the leftover, what I've got left of my ripe tomatoes. I'm going to add this, which is finely sliced uh, rose onion. These are the remaining cucumber slices. So I've got two slices left. And I've got a mixture of my greens, which are mint leaves, down kasom, and um, juliennes of green serrano chili. Okay, these are the juliennes of green serrano chili. Um, these are mint, and I think this is down kasso. No, this is mint as well. Um, yeah. Well, let me, yeah, no, 
Yep, I think this is down castle. Or is it mint? Anyway. Um, this is chili. Anyway, it's all mixed up here. And these are the roasted aubergines. Okay. So the roasted aubergines uh, give it a nice creaminess. Um, so it, it gives it um, uh, almost meaty texture. Okay, it's uh, it's hard to explain, but um, the, the it doesn't taste of much, but it's just the creamy creaminess or, and the texture. So it gives a feeling of um, like a meat sauce kind of thing. Okay, so I'm gonna assemble this, and uh, oh, I've toasted these baguettes earlier with uh, smashed garlic, which I smashed in my mortar and pestle here. Okay, so it uh, has a nice aroma of like garlic bread with uh, garlic. It, I can't call it garlic butter because there's no butter. It's just, um, you know, vigorously or aggressively pound um, garlic smash until the oil comes out. It's the oil that uh, does the magic. And you have to let the oil rest for 10 minutes so there's some garlic chemistry magic that happens that makes it uh, something beneficial for you okay so that's it for today friday 24th of july 2020